Hello everybody, good to see ya. HW here, Romulan Dog, Fardizzle, good to see ya. As always, let me know if audio and everything's good, and it's Achilles. Good luck, have fun. Not sure if it's the Achilles I'm thinking of or not, but either way, good luck, have fun to our opponent. And uh, we'll see what happens from here. Now, we still have a little bit of extra gold. So, how should I spend it? Should I grab one of you? Yeah, screw it. Let's grab more infantry because because I lack imagination. Who needs cavalry when you have Carl Franz and three or no, sorry, four mortar wagons, which is going to be our staple build for today. Kind of like the last stream we were doing, uh, five bloated corpses. This time around, we're going to do four mortar wagons. The reason only four is because uh, I'm just maxing out what would be considered legal under the manor rule set. So. These gotta be at least tournament legal builds. And thank you very much, Romulan. I'm so old. Ready for war. For Look what my friend got me for my birthday. I'm excited to paint. I got some gores. Some gores to go paint. I just need to order the paint online. I haven't painted models in forever. I've never done Warhammer models. I used to do like World War II planes uh, models when I was a kid. So looking forward to getting back into it. My uh, hands are super shaky though. Ever since my kidney transplant, the medicine they have me on gives me hand tremors. So I'm gonna have to get like a stand thing or something, you know, like put the brush in so I can like just like have it stabilized on that. Um, but we'll see. Beastman all the way, man. Your birthday's in two weeks? Hell yeah, well, happy early birthday, bud. Alrighty. Excuse me. <clears throat> this build's gonna be a bit... Worrisome, I think, just because, you know, typically, as you saw when I first loaded it, it has three war regular war wagons and the Sunmaker, so the Sunmaker to kill infantry and the war wagons to kill, like, Chaos Knights and Dragon Ogres and, you know, uh, bigger things like that uh, with their armor piercing around. So now I have an overabundance of just infantry killing power, and I really don't have too much in the way of uh, anti large, so Carl Franz is going to be working overtime. He can do it though, if any lord can single-handedly kill a bunch of uh, Chaos Large units, it's it's Carl Franz. So, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Distinct lack of bears. Yeah, I need bears dragging him around like Kislev. Oh, he's already ready to. What am I doing? Uh... <clears throat> Moving now. I will not stand idle. There was a easier way to go about doing what I just did there. Oh, an exalted hero, eh? Okay, so take position. That's an order. To we gotta battle. be somewhat careful here. Now, take the ground. Go. Pull this way with Carl. Heading out. My subjects call. Moving faster. My rule is absolute. Take position. It is done. 
He's doing a good job on his dodging with the mortars there for sure. I think I'm just gonna get bulldozed here. I'm gonna send forward my first wave of infantry to assault. Okay. Pop that. We'll have you stay in combat for now. You. Let's throw this down on top of Mr. Carl, boy, since he's going to be in combat for a while. Nice searing doom. Going to do a ton of damage, but as long as Carl Franz can get some kills off, we'll call it a win. Okay, Carl Franz is a monster. In case any of you didn't know. And uh, even though he's outnumbered three to one, that overcast regrowth helped a lot. Oh, just kidding, what overcast regrowth I should be saying. I didn't overcast regrowth, apparently. There we go, now the regrowth is overcast on top of Carl. And uh, he is just murdering things and making me a happy boy. Get him! Oh, final trans. Okay, now we'll turn around and stay on top of them. You guys come this way, you guys stay over here, keep the leadership in order. Let's send you over here. Carl. Very well. Obey. <laughs> He's just Take going on a mission. Yes, General. Charge at speed. Quick move. Yeah, we need to get him out of there. His jabs are doing so much work. Go. Moving. Damn. Okay. Carl, no. I have to heal him, otherwise that exalted hero is going to get him. No lingering. Spearman. Go get him. Okay, pull this way. Looks like we're getting some of his horsemen tied up here. Top of them. You guys come over this way. Actually, let's do this. You guys come over here. You get in this way. And I'll trans on top of them again, damn it. It's 464. We're gonna send Carl over here. His only purpose now is to kill Sartorial. And we're just going to keep on playing Ring Around the Rosie with Marauder Horsemen. <laughs> we are okay, got those infantry units taken care of. You come over here. Desperately try to pull this off. Come on, just get a good hit. 
Yes, cool. Sartorial is dead. so careless with Carl, but I just would really like to catch them if possible. Are we gonna do it? I think we can do it. Galmaraz and the Reichland Rune Fang in our back pocket now. Ready to go. He's going to run out of ammunition soon enough, and I don't think he's going to have nearly enough to get through all my units. Quick, 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 before they get a volley off. Yes! I love when it gets timed like that. Now we got our mortar shooting them. They can't stand the power of the quadruple mortar wagon. It's truly just too much. There we go. Arnie Ross is kicking in. GG, well played. Carl Fran, you monster. <laughs> Just throw him into combat against two exalted heroes and uh, Sarthoriel. Granted, I had the infantry advantage, which is why I think I won that, because he just sent his lords into a bunch of infantry and Carl, but still. Carl, monster. So good against chaos. Mortars <laughs> didn't pay for themselves, but style points all the way. New Empire DLC Demi Chariots, yes please. Yeah, I know, my Mac, I had to send the wagons into melee, you know. I really should have been just shooting the entire time, but <laughs> all's well that ends well. so much money just to blow on four mortar wagons. <laughs> We need cavalry in this matchup, but it's also a matchup where I do like to have a lot of chaff. 
it's usually one where I bring Boris to instead of Carl Franz, and I think I'll do that right now. Switch you for Boris. Mr. Todd Bringa. I just think he works well against Beastman. He has good buffs in his AoE debuffs. Um, I think help a lot against the Beastman Chaff. And he has regeneration, which is always nice. Minus nine melee attack, yeah, I'll take it. And then we don't need to take a life caster, which is always nice. So I suppose we could just bring I mean, it's Beastman, Amber Wizard probably makes the most sense so you can get those Manticore summons, but I'm kinda sick of Manticores, so I'm gonna bring a Bright Wizard instead. Let's throw him on a Pegasus. Kindle Flame, sure thing. Burning Head, Fireball. Screw it. Use a blast too. And a power stone. Breaking all my rules with that expensive caster. Now, still leaves us with about a thousand. And that means more powder. Guess I could ditch some swordsmen and bring free company, but swordsmen are good. Bunch of them too. And then we'll just have no no mass. What do you got? Yes. And it's a zero army, so you really can't. You know, can't be defeated. The wagon's all the mass I need. True. I might as well just end it now because I've already won, right? I don't even need to play if I get a perfect spend. I read that in a book once, so it must be true. We are Sigma's heirs! Ready for war! Militia! Free company! Understood? Free company! Militia! Awaiting orders! Spearmen! By Ulrich's wrath! Something like that. Get them right up to the front line. And let's see. So these we guys serve the here. We are Sigma Dead! Spin them! By Ulrich's wrath! Sigma, show us! I am a pyromancer! Okay. The Helden Hammer! Show us the foe! Send GG your opponent, we'll concede. Free company! All right, <clears throat> guess we're ready to go. Are there any tournaments going on that I should have joined? Actually, don't tell me, because then I'll just be bummed, because I just had that thought. There's probably another person's tournament going on that I could have joined. Yes, 
Let's go blow up some gore herd. Looks like a Minotaur's a shield, which is a Calcan Guard. Gray Shaman of Shadows. More gore the Shadow gave. Gray Shaman's gonna have. And Emerald Pendulum is the main thing I care about, so let me keep an eye out for that. Mortar! At speed! For held and hammer! Quick march! For held and hammer! Militia! Swordman! By Galmaraz! Boom. At speed! What a... Here comes the back attack. The Empire endures! Pasta! Wise counsel! Ready! Take the ground! What? No lingering! Prepare for combat! Our weapons are yours! Spearmen! At speed! At speed! Oh! It will be done! Hmm. Let's do it right here. The winds glow hot. I'll burn them. Go to battle. Set for the twin tail. Sweet burning hood. He's got the terror in the back line now. Wise counsel. No. For help and hammer. March. Quick march. Quick go. Sigma calls. Understood. Prepare for combat. Move We are Sigma Sweet. Oh, actually, just keep chasing them. Keep, get them off the map. General. Spearman. Sigma calls. Go. Attack. Okay, fireball. I totally forgot about you. Sorry. Seething fire. <laughs> Blast is pretty satisfying from up at a high angle. It looks kind of looks pretty cool, and the sound effect makes it sound like a Star Wars attack. Hi, bots. Okay. Shit out of everybody in existence. And then, are we really gonna win this battle with our four mortars? I think he just got overcommitted to that backline engagement. Thank you for the three company militia recommendation, Romulan. It definitely uh, proved to be good advice. Formation, march! You know what's wonderful advice? Mortaring your own troops, but eh, I guess they're getting some damage done. <laughs> the Butchers of Calcium Guard at least have a weakness to fire. Burn or another fireball on top of you, my friend. Coming in now. Okay, three company militia are firing in. Another fireball on top of Mr. Caster Lord. How's it good coming? Uh, pendulum. No doubt about that. Yes, 
All right, now all of his debuffs are going to go down in this big fight, and uh, that should help us finish it off. But people are taking it easy on me because it's my birthday. Get on top of these throwing axes. No! GG, well played. We have vanquished the beastmen with our quadruple mortar wagon. Hey, Rotten Lail. Welcome to the stream, and thank you. Yeah, that burning head worked out quite well for me. A list tourney? What's a list tourney? I should know what that is, but I'm not going to brain fart. And thank you, Ron Lell. Yeah, it was a fun one. Let's see. Did we get any good... <laughs> I mean, they didn't pay for themselves. It's really hard to pay for themselves when they cost $9.50. It's an expensive unit. But hey, we're able to pull it off anyways, thanks to that very nice burning head at the very beginning of the game. Other ones, eh, they did okay. But yeah. He still raked up a good amount of value. The Mimma Free Company Militia really, really shined there, in my opinion. Two of them more than paying for themselves. Flagellants, yeah, makes sense against the Beastmen. And then, yeah, the backline engagement could have, that was going to be the decisive moment. And I think he just overcommitted. He underestimated um, the power of terror and just how much infantry I think I had back there. Um, he was trying to get in there, get rear charges on the front line, which is a great idea. And I want to commend him. Uh, he had a good approach. Like, the front lines were engaging as the back line was collapsing in on my formation. Um, RNG just didn't go his way. And like I said, he just overcommitted, got tangled up. And it's a relatively small map, so I was able to route a lot of units off the map there with Boris. So, well played, GG. Let's get another one get another one. I need to enunciate and stop mumbling so much. Oh, my dentist wished happy birthday. Oh my god. Read highlights. Damn. We're gonna have to watch these after this battle as a stream. Curious what these clips are, it looks like, from my bud and I's trip to Iceland. Yeah, that looks like the one where I'm getting attacked by a wren. Any heat. Whew. Oh, four mortar wagons against the elves. Now this is going to be perfect. M M wood elf, wood elf, wood elf. No, we don't have a pre-build. Oh well. One, two, three, four.
Hmm. God damn. Why do I have such a hard time deciding what to do? Guess we need a caster. Pfft. Apparently, we should probably bring one. Do we want fire again? Because I love the lore of fire. Yeah. Okay, now, other than that, 1766. Guess we'll just focus on infantry from here. Usually could have the Sigmar Sons. I love Flagellants, but they can just turn into pincushions here. I think Swordsmen and Spearmen might be the best bet. But we don't have too much money left for him. Free up a tiny bit of money that way. Ah, screw it. Who needs infantry? Psst. Yeah, I'll need infantry. Probably very badly, so. Enough messing around. Let's get serious. Let's get some infantry in here. Um, screw it. Just go with something like that. Won't have much in the way of anti-large, but... been ready for a while, hasn't he? Sorry, dude. Okay, let's get this, yeah, this army feels by far the weakest, <laughs> but uh, I guess Wood Elves are probably the strongest faction we've gone up against today anyway, so let's see what we can do. Now, this map does have some pretty awful terrain features that we can use to our advantage, try to uh, funnel perhaps uh, the Wood Elves into some unfavorable engagements and uh, prevent hopefully the full strength of their kite potential. The Empire endures. Yes, you guys come here. You can stay up there in the air. You come right here. We are Sigmar's heirs. Yep, that's it. That's that's the army. Hey, <laughs> Sigmar, obey me! Nobody expects the quadruple mortar wagons. We 
nice. We're gonna get a huge charge on these great stag knights. Nice penumbral pendulum from my opponent. My burning head. Looks like it's at least getting some contact, though. No lingering. To battle. Yes, sir. Quickly. The empire endures. Master. It will be done. Wise counsel. I'll burn them. Yes, quickly. We await your orders. Prepare the combat. Read. Okay, you do this. You turn around and start bombing them, please. Get him, get him. They're not even near me anymore. Get them. Get them way watchers. Get up and kill him. Come on, Boris. <laughs> if you could cause terror, it'd be really cool right about now. Just get a good old terror route going down here, please. Try to give him friendly fire. Come on. You can do this, my friend. They're almost... Oh, no, they're not even close to out of ammunition, what am I saying? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Quickly. Ready. Charge! The winds blow hot. Winter Heart Guard? No. Still not dead yet. What the hell? <laughs> no. We watch us. It will be done at speed. Get up in the air. Don't route. Come on, you can do this, buddy. Yes, quickly. Or no, you can't, can you? Don't you get routed off the map right now? Come on, just hang in there a little bit longer. Just a little bit longer, Boris. No, no such luck. GG, well played <laughs> to our opponent. He got us a good. Those, those, the, the way watchers. I, 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 yeah, I, I couldn't, I, I, I couldn't get the way watchers. What you gonna do? Uh, 
Ay, ay, ay. Kami scum. I have to be honest, I'm getting sick of these four mortar wagons. They haven't been very effective so far. I'm trying to think of what I could use to augment them, but nothing's really coming to mind. But on that note, give me a second, guys. I'm going to go to the bathroom, but I'll be right back. And we're back. <laughs> oh, well, this is a anti scaven army right here. But we do, we do need to pick somebody to lead it. And that person shall be none other than you, good sir. And then we're going to bring, you guessed it, a bright wizard. Which all that nonsense. And actually, we're going to bring piercing bolts of burning too. I want to try something out. Do that, and then we have 550 left, which means we should get one of you guys out of here. Oh, why can't we get any, oh, you can get at least one calf, but, oh well. That's what happens when you rush through a build with four mortar wagons. Time is of the essence, we must get to battles. Understood! 
Alright, let's see how it goes. <laughs> I'm glad my opponent recognized the four wagons last battle. Hopefully he gave me some style points even though he trounced me. It's like how he's crisscrossing them so he can hit him in the flank somewhat. It's nice. Nice choice. Routing those storm vermin? Mortars. Doing the work. God bless him. Who is this? Weak head taker? Oh man. I have to say, admire this guy's army. You know what also I've forgotten to do is <laughs> uh, use fireball like once. Hmm, blast doing some good work there. Surprising amount of good work. Shit, come on, Marcus, what are you doing? You're supposed to run, you idiot. I hate you, Marcus. How could you get killed there? Clearly it's not my fault. It is all the computer's fault. I'm not shifting blame. So maybe uh, we could use some of our, I don't know, units that we've kept back here the whole time. But I guess we'll just keep fireballing Mr. Quick Head Taker since that's probably the most cost effective way to go about it. Oh wow, or I'll just, you know, hit my own wagons instead. Okay, no really great burning head targets right now, in my opinion at least. So I'm gonna hold on that. Got a chieftain here. Sweet head taker. You guys can do this. There we go. Fireball. Let's finish off the mutant rat ogre. I don't see any uh, beast masters. Not beast masters. I forget what they're called. Like pack masters. 
So I don't think they can heal the mutant rat over or anything, but better safe than sorry. You come this way. No lingering! Move out! Okay, looks like we're gonna do this. Yes, quickly! The ground quakes! To battle! One, two, punch. Okay, over here. Can, what can you guys do? Like they got some units grouping up together at least. Ooh, ouch! That volley hurt a lot. Hmm. Not gonna be worth the magic. At speed! Quick march! What do you think? Charge! Spearman! Take the ground! Moving! Yes, quickly! On way to battle! March! Go! Taking position! Charge! The winds grow hot! Can I hit him? Is that going to get him to route at all? No. I'm probably just going to get my caster no killed. So maybe I should send somebody else in here. To battle! Detachments move! By Galmaran! For the Warhammer! There we go. Got the Chieftain routing. Send our caster after him. Through that fireball. We're gonna go after all these Skaven with our wagons now. You guys can come over here, regroup with them. You, no, 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 no. We gotta push through. Those poison wind mortars are doing work. Come on, just keep pulling through. Oh no, Queek is coming for you. Got that Firecaster. Still chasing him. No. Forgot about my Empire Knights. Obviously. Let's go ahead and pull these guys out before Queek kills them all. Might be too late. He's already killed off two models on that one, so we're down to one. Damn, Queek. You monster. Okay, over here. Getting these guys. Okay, pull through. Let's run. Oh, yeah. Ah! Queek, stay away! He's a frightening lord right now. Got map respect for my opponent for bringing him in the first place. Okay, got them routed. Got them. Okay. Slowly but surely. That's why they've been so weird on the controls. I forgot to take them out of skirmish mode. I'm a big old idiot. Oh, 
push it! 22 minutes to check in! Thank you, Romulan. I hope you just posted that message so I'm not too late. Take the ground! Take a position! Take position! For France! Go! Okay, if we can catch them right here, it's over. Plant and paperwork things to do. Do you know what style tourney is it is it is? Is it just single elimination or what? I kill you. I think we have this one in the bag as soon as we get one of these lords routed and the army launcher should kick in. up just in time to get knocked over again. Or no, I guess they have that immunity to it after a minute. Yes, General! Attack! Quick march! Kindle flame! Take it to the face! Yes. Finally. I can't really kill Queen Head Taker though. That apparently is the question now. No lingering! At speed! Let us go! Formation mark! Take Wait for the infantry to get here! We serve the Emperor! Yes, quickly! Come on, infantry, we need you desperately. Go! Take 
the ground for the Emperor! Taking position! Yes, sir, quickly! Take the ground! Okay, come on, come on, come on! Yes, there we go. GG, well played to our opponent. Now I will end the stream for a second, go take a bathroom break, rename it, restart it, and uh, check out that tournament bracket. And also, let me go take a look at that tournament bracket right now. 18 players. Oh wow, we got Ethan Star in there. Banner rules. All right, yeah, that's perfect. Only 18 people so far, so especially if we lose, it may be quick. Anywho, uh, on that note, everybody, uh, let's go ahead and wrap up the stream from here. Hope you guys enjoyed it for Mortar Wagon Builds. Funnily enough, yeah, against the Skaven, I guess maybe they could be viable. <laughs> they seem to get plenty of val val uh, value here, not only with their ranged attacks, but also just in melee in the late game. So, God bless them with an Earth Blood, they would be even more vicious. And uh, definitely didn't micro Marcus very well there. Queek Head Taker and the Double Chieftains, man, that's vicious. They just go and murder lords. And Queek, look at the value he got. I mean, good for him. That's that's a I killed like a fourth of my army, so that's that's no small feat. Well done to him. Uh, Empire Knights, got some good kill counts at least. But um, yeah, good game, and uh, I enjoyed the mortar wagons. Let me know if you have any thoughts for what to meme with next, as far as our competitive meme multiplayer builds go. Um, but until then, I will see you next time. I don't know. I it, but, 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 but words are escaping me, so that's a sign I should in the stream. Anyways, take care. I'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs>